by the biological indicators, you've not yet recovered from hibernation. I'll activate the recovery program now. Awake, sleeping PT. During the flight, there was a malfunction in the hibernation program that resulted in temporary amnesia and damage to the vocal cords. I told you that it was a terrible idea to fly for some mythical stone of immortality to some weird planet. You really think you can revive me? That you can bring my conscience back to the body? Okay. I didn't expect to have to teach a mercenary how to fight, but I have no choice. Raven will teach you how to control the exosuit and I'll display the targets on the screen. Use the left stick to walk. To open the door to the next stage, press the button. physically or using the right stick. Adam, I see you're starting to recover from hibernation. I hope all of this wasn't in vain and we actually find this heart of resurrect. Wave your hands up and down while holding the left stick to run. You, of course, are a dangerous and tough mercenary who isn't used to running away from danger. But who knows what awaits you on Resurrect. You can access the exosuit firmware interface and change button bindings at any time. You know, when you're pressing buttons in the exosuit menu, it's like I can feel your touches. <laughs> with the grip button. Put your hand on a ledge, hold the grip, push yourself up, and then release the button. And here's my favorite part. Let's remember why you were nicknamed Deadhook. Extend your right arm forward and upward. Press the A button to activate the hook. When the hook catches onto the surface, quickly pull your arm towards yourself to perform a leap. You can also release the hook from the left glove using the X button. By the way, the coins in the air are all favorite and this currency exists on Resurrects, there are likely intelligent creatures there. trigger to shoot. What a creepy creature. I see you're getting into it. You can store weapons in magnetic holsters. Release the grab to retrieve the weapon from the holster. Take another weapon. Oh my god, I just remembered how you stole a holographic sphere and smashed those disgusting beetles heads with both hands. Dual wield weapons using 
pressing the trigger button. and exosuit display. No one health enemies are glowing white. Pull yourself towards the enemy with the hook to finish them off and gain HP. Execution absorbs the enemy. Oh, how it exploded! But that doesn't mean I approve of your killings. Adam, your exosuit has a built-in error impulse generator called Gust. It's a cool gadget. <laughs> I remember how you once knocked out a thug who was bothering me at Hypo with the gust. Your exosuit is equipped with additional features. One of them is gust. To select it, hold down the beep. To use the gust, hold the trigger, build up and... Wow, you're practically a wizard, Adam. The second function is the freezer. Activate it. To use the freezer, direct your Your suit is equipped with additional armor. Armor status information is displayed on the exosuit display above the HP bar. Flamethrower is the third feature of the exosuit and is used to point your palm at the end of the Reserat. There are hollow burn storage units. To open them, hold the hollow burn roads with the grab button and pull them sideways. Hollow burns contain valuable resources. Use the grab button to take the amplifier from the hollow burn. Just a reminder, amplifiers are compact energy containers with upgrades for your exosuit and weapons. Also, your exosuit has the gut dripper function. Laser blades. It charges up after tearing apart enemies. The number of charges for a sword strike is displayed on the back of your right hand. This is your ultimate. You were able to rip an enemy's limb off even without an exosuit. Let's see what you're capable of now. Enemies with low health are vulnerable to melee attacks. Try punching it. <laughs> Try to tear the enemy apart with your hands. Activate the ultimate by holding the grip button on both controllers. By sharply swinging the sword, your right glove is equipped with the E-Saw function. You will find the rope to activate the E. Hold down the trigger to activate the chain. Attack the enemy with the saw to kill him instantly. It is recommended to use the E saw in case of a high degree threat of life. process is completed. <laughs> when you come back with the stain of immortality, we can finally do some things again. Well, you know, not via the damn brain computer interface. Where did 
did you end up? The energy gate was supposed to transport you to the planet's surface? The geolocation was disrupted due to an electromagnetic anomaly. Wow, where did this hollow burn storage come from? Let me try to hack it. Bingo! Adam, I've gained access to the hollow burn firmware. They were installed by the miners from a city called Cordcaster on the planet's surface. The Cordcaster miners dug up this place. According to their records, it's a temple called the Halls of Shogor. The miners blocked the doors for some reason. I hacked them and removed the blockage. Faster! Find the EMP source! These creatures are protecting the EMP source! Kill them all! If you dodge an attack in time, you can activate Rapid, which drastically speeds up your reflexes. is in the next room. Faster to destroy it. There's almost no time left.
power supply has been restored. Restarting the system. What? How? Why? The EMP source is significantly weakened. The power core has been restored. These creatures were connected to the source of the EMP. It turns out to be an insect-like creature, a, a giant beetle. You've done a massive damage to them and weakened the source. Oh, hooray! I wish I could kiss you. Grace, you can initiate a physical contact with Adam after finding the Stone of Immortality. <laughs> Can't wait. Surely the stone is somewhere that is bloody beetle. Restarting the system caused damage to the exosuit. Now I have to re-improve your exosuit with injections. Grace, please remind Adam of the ship's functionality. Fine, fine. Let me remind you how you equipped Raven with the money from your contract killings. There's a shooting range on the ship where you can train killing infernals. Next to the training ground, there are panels for printing weapons and summoning enemies. Raven will update their database when you encounter new ones on Resurrect. They're used to create injections to upgrade the exosuit. I've put together a recipe book for you. The Smuggler's Cookbook. Upgrade your exosuit. I won't let you leave without an injection. Take the tablet and the upgrades injections you want to create. There, familiarize yourself with the ingredients in the recipe necessary for the preparation of the serum. Insert the flask into the dispenser. Use the rotary lever to pour the components into the flask. To mill the components, put the necessary components into the grinder. Place the empty flask in the grinder to get the desired result. You need to select the compression ratio. Choose it according to the recipe. Pull the lever down, and the components will be converted to the required resource. Take the flask with the liquid and put it in the centrifuge. Press the start button on the centrifuge to initiate the mixing process. Take the resulting serum with the grip button, point it at the other hand, and activate it with the trigger. 
good boy. You can return to Resurrect. Let's find that damn stone as soon as possible. I'm tired of living in digital form. Explore this strange place. As you approach the object, there'll be a circle to start scanning. When it's full, I'll be able to tell you more about the object. I deciphered part of the data on Infernals. These monsters are undead, Adam. It seems like they came to resurrect from another reality. Freaky.
invisible. It becomes visible again when it shoots. Attack before it's gone. Dodge sideways to avoid its shots. No infernals in the next room. Oh, we can take a break. It seems there's some kind of sacred place there. There are hollow burns here for purchasing weapons and amplifiers, a workbench for upgrading guns, and much more. You can spend them coins. This underground temple was created by the race of the ancients. The 
race of the ancients lived in the dungeons of Razorak several centuries ago. In search of resources, they excavated a branched network of underground cities. Animals and temples. According to the records, this room served as a resting place for the ancient warriors. They underwent some kind of trials in the temple. The trial rooms were equipped with numerous traps to test the candidates who wished to reach a certain eye of the ancients for their endurance. I don't know what that is, but it seems that this thing is somehow connected to an anomaly.
release a self-guided clot of plasma fire. Shoot down its project arms in the air and aim for its back when the armor is weaker. when the ability is charged.
terrifying. The miners refer to them as infernals in their notes. Adam, are you okay? Your suit is equipped with the reatomization system. In case of critical damage, it splits into atoms and is transported to the nearest biochamber. I wish I had such an exosuit when I was dying. I wouldn't have had to transfer my consciousness to Raven and fly here. Do you remember how we met? I was singing at Hyper and you can take your eyes off me all night. You know, back then I'd already given up on becoming a famous singer and saw no point in life. But you, you brought it back to me. So happy. God, if only we could go back to those times. tasks for Cordcaster soldiers in their database. They mostly involve killing infernals. There are rewards offered for their heads, cool guns, amplifiers. I thought you might want to participate too. 